case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. The pivotal case of Jones v. Clinton, heard in 1998 by the United States District Court for the Eastern District of Arkansas, caused waves throughout the nation. The crux of the dispute rested on the accuser, Paula Corbin Jones, who alleged that then-Governor Bill Clinton and former Arkansas State Police Officer Danny Ferguson had sexually harassed her. Their interactions, she claimed, devolved into an uninvited sexual advance, where Clinton allegedly exposed himself to her and asked her to touch him. In retaliation, Jones brought forth a sweeping lawsuit, taking aim at Clinton and Ferguson on sexual harassment grounds, as well as constitutional violation, conspiracy, and emotional distress. The case's initial hearing yielded a setback for Jones. Clinton and Ferguson, pushing back against the allegations, filed motions for summary judgment resulting in partial dismissal of the case. Undeterred, Jones found new legal representation, amended her complaint, and rushed back to court. Again, Clinton and Ferguson leaned on their motions for summary judgment, this time securing a favorable result. The court established that the plaintiff's allegations of sexual harassment were unsubstantiated, lacking the essential proof to stand up under legal scrutiny. Specifically, the court argued that there were no clear signs of a severe or pervasive behavior that would have created a hostile work environment, nor could Jones demonstrate that she had suffered any tangible job detriment as a result of rebuffing the alleged sexual advances. As such, these claims were deemed invalid and were dismissed. Yet there was one silver lining for Jones. Although most of her assertions were cast aside, her claim of emotional distress, backed by specific evidence, found traction. However, her attempts to raise claims of sexual assault and outrage fell on deaf ears, dismissed due to a glaring lack of evidence. As such, despite the fanfare and media attention, the hefty lawsuit resulted primarily in disappointment for the accuser. Case briefs and so much more. LS Data's got what you're looking for. Visit LSE.law, elevate your mind. Leave the stress of class. 